This is daily vlog number 222. The rumors are true. It's time again for another 60 second Sunday sermon summary. Here we go. In Luke 18, Jesus tells a parable of two guys praying in the temple. One of them is a religious leader thanking God that he is not like all of these sinners around him, including that tax collector. This guy is the perfect example of the eighth terrible temptation every Christian faces. Pride. Pride tempts us to think that we are greater than we are, that we are better than others, and that we ultimately don't need God. Pride infects the believer like a cancer spreading to every aspect of our faith, making it impossible for us to love God and love others as we were created to. But if pride is the cancer, then humility is the chemo. The tax collector in the parable demonstrates the humble mindset that Jesus applauds. He stands at a distance from the altar, unable to lift his eyes toward heaven, and beats at his chest saying, have mercy on me, a sinner. And that's humility. It's not humiliating ourselves, but knowing who we are. That we are God's beloved children who have not always lived up to that love. Humility relies on God for what we cannot earn for ourselves. Forgiveness through Jesus Christ, who though he was God, came to serve and save us by giving his life. Would that we'd all choose Christ-like humility over self-serving pride. Because that is the key to loving and living the life of joy that God offers us in Jesus Christ. So tell me, who's been a great example of humility for you? Someone who's shown a Christ-like self-giving love that you don't normally see in other people. Let me know in the comments below. This has been Daily Vlog number 222. 143 to go. I'll talk to you tomorrow.